Very interesting things are happening in the field of electric vehicle batteries, friends, especially with China's CATL. Chinese $10 EV battery could upend the US auto market. Welcome back, everyone. China has a new EV battery and it's $10 per kilowatt hour. China's breakthrough sodium ion battery priced at $10 kilowatt hour is a technical marvel. It's a direct challenge to America's lithium-dependent auto industry. For context, today's cheapest lithium-ion phosphate LFP batteries cost $75 per kilowatt hour, while Tesla's 46AD battery cell, however, nears $100 per kilowatt hour. At one-tenth the price, sodium-ion technology could make budget electric vehicles like the $25,000 Tesla Model 2 financially viable overnight. American potential EV buyers, hesitant because of costs, will be comforted by this news when it comes. Now, Chinese engineers at CATA, the world's largest electric vehicle battery maker, have begun mass producing sodium ion battery cells at their new 30 gigawatt hour facility in Fujian province with plans to supply automakers like Cherry and BYD by late 2025. CATL is also a major Tesla battery supplier. This is a lap hub. CATL's first gen sodium batteries already power 250,000 urban delivery vans across China offering 120 to 160 watt hour kilogram energy density. For cars, more needs to be done about range, but a 10,000 life cycle to Tesla's 1,500 lifespan speaks volume. Best for grid storage and city cars, the economics are transformative. Sodium ion production costs 70% less than lithium package because of abundant materials. Sodium carbonate costs $200 tons versus lithium carbonate $15,000 per ton. These are 2025 prices. Did you see the difference? 70% costing less than lithium. Simplified mining, extractable from seawater or Wyoming's Green River Basin, 90% of global reserves. No cobalt nor nickels. Skips conflict minerals tied to Congo's mines. Remember the stories with Congo's mines, apparently children working there. This skips that conflict extortion free it cannot be held to ransom by anyone in lithium supply implications for u.s buyers if adopted domestically sodium batteries could slash entry-level electric vehicle prices by eight thousand to twelve thousand dollars making models like the chevy bolt 2.0 a ford e-transit one accessible to millions of car buyers friends america's automakers are repeating history. Just as GM clung to gas-guzzling V8s during the 1970s oil crisis, today's EV strategies rely entirely on lithium, a mineral with 1,400% price volatility since 2020. If lithium supplies tighten again, for example, example Bolivia nationalizes reserves or Australia's mines strike, the fallout would be catastrophic. What do you think about this new type of battery that China and CATA, the major Tesla battery supplier, is already using? This is Armin Haryan from TorqueNews.com. Uh, please subscribe to our channel and let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. And if you like this story, please give us a thumbs up. I would greatly appreciate it. God bless you and I'll see you soon in our next report.